Oh, I can't perfect. believe I did per this. Perfect timing. Okay. Okay. Perfect timing. Okay. Okay. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, oh, yeah, we're we're going to let Charlie take that. Charlie and Brago is here from Gladys Porter Zoo. I'm so nervous. I can't believe I dared to do that with a I desert. I put you on the spot. Yeah, <laughs> with a desert sure. king snake. Tell us more about it. Yes, yeah, so um, this is um, one of two that we have in our education department. And within its name, you know, they're, they're kind of like in that category of the king of snakes because they um, eat other snakes. That's probably one of wow. their, uh, their, their thing. Of course, they have to be a little bit smaller than them. Yeah. But um, for the most part, I mean, I, a few weeks ago, I brought a gray banded king snake. And right. the same type of rules apply with them. They're immune to other snake venom. And they are very, um, even though this one's pretty good and, and he's, he's uh, pretty friendly, but they can be very aggressive. They're very strong snakes. They're very you know, aggressive if they need to when it comes to, of course, to feeding time. Right. And do, I mean, are, is it going to grow even longer? It'll it's be a little, big. yeah. It'll get a little bit bigger. Um, uh, we've had it for a, a while there at the zoo, and and um, he eats once a week at once the zoo. A week. Yeah, once is a week. Is he going to eat? Jim? Yeah, yeah. So <laughs> where do these grow? Or where are these uh, usually at? Part of the so world? there, there are um, a lot of them are found like in in the different part of kind of like California, Arizona okay. area. A lot of king snakes. Those desert type. Yeah, so they're kind of the desert, yeah. yeah. So like that desert area um, all along that um, that part of the United States. And for the most part, king snakes are found in that area anyways. Mm -hmm. yeah, Interesting. Sure. And hey, there's a great event coming up that you're going to want to check out. Tell us more about it. Yeah, so we have the Ridley Rush uh, One Mile Walk Run. So all the proceeds for this um, fun run um, goes to Sea Turtle Conservation. And we have a whole program, um, an event that day um, immediately after the Ridley Rush, and it'll be a great time. So registration starts this Saturday, well, technically Sunday at midnight. Oh, wow. That's coming up. So you got to take advantage of that. And certainly, if you go, don't forget no, to go yeah. and check out the Desert King Snake. I want Jimbo it to hold it. It doesn't look oh, as crazy boy. as you oh, think. Oh, boy. Oh, no, it's not, he's, he's not bad at all. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Look at like that. Like it's nobody's business. See, and he likes gray suits. Can you tell? God, he is, you can just tell he's, per, like he's strong. He's, 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 yeah. he's, a, he's a strong guy. He's there a you go. strong guy and <laughs> strong winds outside. Uh, yeah, we got right strong now. winds. Oh, here there's your forecast. See if I can read this and not freak out at the same time. We got one chance of rain on Saturday, that along with the front that's moving through, and then we dry things out for Sunday and Monday. So the good news is the humidity will be disappearing. The humidity Look at this. will be. But I, I, this thing. <laughs> Oh, we just showed ourselves today. We are strong. We are strong people. We're not freaking we, out at all, are we? No, we're absolutely not. You don't you even need, need me. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, I think we do, to be honest with you. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you for, for watching. watching us this afternoon. <laughs> I, I don't know if you guys will be daredevils out there, but enjoy we'll see you tomorrow Thursday. morning. <laughs> Bye.